In this Playray tutorial, I will discuss how to add screenshot into Playwright test report. We will discuss the two scenarios. First one is how to add a screenshot when test is getting failed. And a second scenario is how to add a screenshot into the Playwright test report when test case is getting passed. Here I will navigate to the VS code and I will open one of the spec file here and I will run the this test. So this time you won't be finding the screenshot added into the playwright test report. And if you see here, so our test is getting passed and I will open the test report now. And if you see here, in this test report, screenshot is not added, right? So this time, screenshot won't be present because we have not enabled the screenshot flag in the playwright.config.ts file. So let's enable the screenshot flag in the playwright.config.ts file. So you can come to this particular file and you can scroll to the use and inside the use you need to add a configuration called screenshot screenshot colon and here you need to specify the value so there are four options you can permanently switch off the capturing screenshot and adding into the playwright test report and second option is on that means irrespective of the test status, test outcome status, it will add the screenshot into the playwright test report. And a third option is on first failure. So whenever you have uh, done a setup for the retrying of uh, failed test cases, third option is useful. And the last option is only on failure. So in our case, we will enable this only on failure. We want to capture the screenshot and add that screenshot into the playwright test report. So I will go to the same spec file. So here I will update some expected value so that our test will get failed. So here I'll add playwright type script by tester stop. So it is going to check the this particular web page title and it will get failed. And in this case, it should capture the screenshot and also it should add that screenshot into the playwright test report. And if you see here in the background, so there is a failure and expected string and the received strings are not matching. So this is the expected failure. So now let's go to the our report once again. Now this time screenshot should be added to the our HTML report with the exception details. If you see here previously this was not present. So whenever test case is failed that time only you will see this errors section and after that test steps and if you scroll down here there is an another section added called screenshot so now we have enabled the screenshot capturing so that's the reason playwright is able to capture the screenshot when test case is getting failed also so simply you can click on this screenshot you can view the full screenshot of the captured one. So this is how we can enable the configuration in the playwright.configuration.ts file for capturing the screenshot when test is getting failed. Let's say I want to capture the screenshot when my test is getting passed also, right? So if I run this test, so this test will work fine and you will not 
find the screenshot in the playwright test report and if you see here our test is working fine so let me go to the report so i will refresh this report and if you see here our test is getting passed but i am not able to see the screenshot here so it is very simple configuration again you can go to the vs code and uh, playwright.config.ts file so simply you need to pass the value as on so irrespective of the test outcome status it is going to capture the screenshot and it will add to the playwright test report so if i run the same test now so here our test is getting executed and if you see here our test is test is getting passed now i will open the playwright test report so let me open the index.html report so i will go to the my test and if you see here the first section is test steps so here you can see all the steps as a part of the test case what are the steps got executed and if you scroll down here you will see the another section called screenshots and here you will find the all the screenshot so whenever you have enabled a configuration in the playwright.config.ts file all the captured screenshot screenshots will be present in the playwright test report so this is how you can capture the screenshot and add into the playwright test report